Welcome back to Biafra News Support Biafra, people of goodwill, Ada Biafra here. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening to you. Depending on where you're watching me from, Biafra, I bring you another update, another Woto Woto update coming from Biafra Prime Minister Mazda Samanepa's official ex handle. There is a video that I will put the link or I will put it on the screen. There will be no voice of uh, Biafra resistant fighters to Unuli, dealing, Unuli, dealing with uh, terrorists coming to Biafra land to terrorize Biafra. To kill Biafra mothers and children, you see our gallant men, people in their houses were the ones that videoed this. They were surprised seeing our gallant men dealing with these uh, terrorists coming to Biafra land to terrorize Biafra. And uh, after now, Nigeria army will come on social media to lie to their gullible Fulani and uh, those that hate freedom. That's how they, how they busted IPOB ESN camp. We don't have any ESN anymore. There is nothing like ESN in this very struggle, in this very new dimension, we are not, there is nothing like ESN. As long as they have confirmed handling ESN over to Southeastern governors, there is nothing like ESN anymore. So, Bia Friends, Bia Friends Prime Minister posted this very update and I'm bringing it to you here. I will also read some comments from Bia Friends. Before I continue, I would like to welcome all the new and old subscribers. If you're coming across my channel for the first time, kindly click the red subscribe button. Turn on the notification bell right beside it to enable you get notification once I upload a new video. Don't forget to share, like, leave your comment at the comment section and please turn in once you get notification. So, Bia Friends, who must continue one thing the zoo terrorists in army uniform and the zoo uh full and caliphate need to understand is that they can't win this very well see this is what they are bringing to biafra land they can't win it so biafra friends as we proceed pay attention and please share as you watch so biafra prime minister said yesterday a unit of uh, biafra resistant fighters in uli command was seen in a video engaging the terrorist in a in a first battle they came to kill Bia France yesterday and met a heavy resistance. Terrorist Nigeria Army, will, you will never win this war. Of course, they can never win this war. They are bringing to Biafra land. Yesterday was very, very hot for them. Yesterday was very, very hot for them. Don't also forget that Biafra Prime Minister also posted a video of people videoing our gallant men dealing with zoo criminals in a, in a police uniform. They abandoned their vehicle and fleeing uh, into the bush. After now, Nigeria will come and tell you how they busted IPAB ESN camp. Uh, uh, many of them fleeing into the bush with bullet wounds. All lies. All lies. Saw the video of them running inside the bush, abandoning their vehicle. The more they come to Biafra land, the more they meet their end. They can't win this very war. Not now, not ever. As long as they say Biafrans will not have peace in Biafra land, let's see how they will have peace. Let's see how they will have peace. So kudos to Biafra resistant fighters. Keep it up. Biafra land is not how they were not. Fulani Islamic jihadists can uh, uh, never survive or have access into Biafra territory in million years to come. Any of them, any Fulani terrorist uh, soldiers or any Boko Haram Nigeria soldiers, uh, police, has stepped his foot into Biafra land will meet his end. Biafra land is no longer that land you people go and do as you please and go on challenge. If you people come to Biafra land this time around, be ready to meet your end. The earlier you people realize that Biafra land is not a place where you people can take over, is not that particular land you people know before now that you can come, go to Imo State, go to Anambra State, Enugu State, go to Ebony State, break havoc, set buildings ablaze, destroy properties, and go on challenge. Biafra land is no longer that land that zoo tourists, I mean, will be seen chasing our old, old fathers with their helos in our own land, even on Easter Sunday. The day I saw the video of Nigeria, me chasing an old father that came out to look around. He was on compound. He was being chased and even shot at by Nigeria. I mean, they chased him with their helos and even shot at him in our own land. I was like, what kind of humiliation is this in our own land? Can they do this in the north? The answer is no. Can, do, can the Nigeria, me go to the north and display all this humiliation in the north? The answer is no. They choose to come to South East to humiliate the people of South East because to them, they believe that we are conquered people and they can treat us as, we, as they please. But right now, uh, they, they, it has changed. No longer they, they wear those flay fools, you know, allow them to treat their own people. Those flay fools that call themselves South East politicians, they are ready to sell out their people to remain in office. Right now, we have volunteers, we have gallant men defending Biafra land, resisting them in all front. And neutralizing them at the same time. You can't come to my land to humiliate me. Something you cannot do in the north. Something they cannot do in the north. They are coming to southeast to do it. 
But Biafra resistant fighters, Biafra liberation army, all Biafra forces said enough is enough. It cannot continue. If you people cannot do all this in the north, then you can. You people cannot also do it in the in, in southeast. That is what is going on now. With all this humiliation, you see some gullible and watched one Nigerians asking us why we are fighting for freedom, why we want to exit. Is Nigeria working for you? No, is Nigeria you asking us why we want to exit Nigeria? Is Nigeria working for you? You asking us why we are fighting Nigeria Army? Is Nigeria Army have they not committed enough atrocity in Southeast to be resisted? Some of you prefer suffering in Dazu than to fight for your freedom. But we are different people. We are children of Chukwu Kikabiyama. We know who we are. We have gallant men defending Biafra land. Those of you that laughed at us when they were destroying our properties, telling us, oh, you're not ready and you're fighting for freedom. You're fighting to exit Nigeria. Now you fully want Nigeria I mean, will do this and that. Now they are the ones crying. You don't know. Go and ask Musa and Lagwaja. Those terrorizing Biafra land before now and after terrorizing Biafra land, they will go on challenge and no longer going on challenge. They have been neutralized by Biafra gallant men. Enough is enough. Men are always gallant and up to the task. Nigeria can never win this very war because this is not 1967-1970. They never won 1967-1970. They said no victory, no vanquish. But to the full and ease, their master Britain is telling, oh, these people are conquered people. Go, go, go and terrorize them. Go and push them to the wall. Let them retaliate so that we'll tell the world that they are the aggressors. They want to tell the world that we are the aggressors. But their evil plan is backfiring. They never believed that gallant men like this will emerge in Biafra land. When we tell you about new dimension, you thought we were playing. Those that plan to take us on our ways are now crying in pain. They're now crying in shame because they never, they never expected what is happening to them in Southeast. Southeast was a place they will come set buildings ablaze. You see them parading our, our communities, our, our villages and the communities without anybody challenging them. And the, 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 the security outfit Madike created to put a stop to the raping of our Biafra mothers and the, and, the, and the women in the farm was handed over to Southeastern governors that never cared, that don't care about their people until Biafra Prime Minister created Biafra Liberation Army, Biafra Resistant Fighters that are dealing with, dealing with these, I mean, these uh, killers in army uniform coming to Biafra land to terrorize Biafra land. This is not 1967-1970. They can't take us on our words this time around and they can't win this very war. Our Biafra Liberation Army, Biafra Resistant Fighters, and all Biafra forces remain formidable. They are resilient, fearless, resolute, strong, and determined to protect lives and properties of Biafrans. May Chukwoki Gabi Amagos, our ancestors, heroes, heroize, guide, protect, strengthen, and uphold all of them now and uh, going forward. Ise, 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 Chukwoki Gabi is their is is strength. And be your friends are telling them to continue with the great work they are doing. Enough of the marginalization, enough of the humiliation in our own land, enough of the intimidation. The way they are running around, the way Nigeria Army, Nigeria police are running around in Biafra communities, villages, towns, they can't do that in the north. The way they are humiliating mountain checkpoints from pillar to pole in the southeast, they can't do that in the north or the west. So why are they doing it in southeast? And why do some of you proudly suffering and smiling Nigerians want us to allow them to continue with all this humiliation and intimidation, all this marginalization in Southeast? Are we not humans? Are we not, are we not qualified to be, to be free in our own land? Are we not supposed to live peacefully and happily in our own land without fear? So why do you people want us to allow them to continue terrorizing us in our own land? If you can't fight for your freedom, leave those that are fighting for their freedom to fight for their freedom. Since you have chosen to remain a happy slave, continue. We are doing the needful because that is what the international community has told us. Former France uh, uh, minister said, defend yourself. And that is what we are doing in Biafra land. They said no amount of petition can help us that we should go and defend ourselves. Those of you that say, oh, international communities, will not be, we are defending ourselves. That is what they told us to do. That we should defend ourselves. If we are being killed in our land, that we should defend ourselves. And that is what Biafra Liberation Army or Biafra forces are doing. As you can see on this very video right now, they are doing the needful. Resisting those that come to Biafra, that, that are coming to Biafra land to kill Biafrans. Amadika said it. One said to Biafrans, go and listen to Simon Epa. 
Amadike said, go and listen to Simon Ekba. He is doing a great job. Absolutely wonderful job that Simon Ekba is doing. You must listen to him and share his videos accordingly. He is bringing a new dimension. Did you hear that? He is bringing a new dimension. That is what they will never tell you. But they would be fast to tell you, ah, Amadike said, I'm I, I, DOS, and DOS is me. What have they done in defending Biafra land, in protecting lives and properties of Biafrans? Since they sold Amadike, if not for Biafra Prime Minister that Chukwu Kikabiyama is using to defend Biafra land through our gallant men, they would have succeeded with their jihad plan in Biafra land. Imagine Nigeria army invading communities, villages, patrolling with armor tank helos lined up, as if there is a war going on, as if the, those terrorists in the north are in southeast. They can't do all these things in the north. So what makes Nigeria me think they can come to southeast and do all the things they cannot do in the north? Because we have a filet fools that told them to, 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 to surround every corner of Biafra land. Nobody will say anything. The real owners of the land has risen up to defend themselves, their land, and their properties. And they will stop at nothing until we exit that contraption fully. And there will be no terrorists in Biafra land. Nigeria is needed in the north, but they are not in the north. Things they cannot do in the north, they are coming to southeast to do it. Mountain checkpoint from pillar to pole, something they cannot do in the north or the west. Well, you see them in southeast doing it. But right now, gallant men are, are telling them that enough is enough. And they are fully out to resist them in all front and neutralize them. Since they are proving stubborn. Leave southeast. Unity is not by force. Unity is not by force. So, dear friends, let me read some comments from dear friends. Let me read some comments from dear friends. Somebody said, a precise counter-terrorist operation to decimate terrorist invader who thought that the that, uh, inheritance of uh, Biafrans can be theirs by invading the Holy Nation USB, which they started since 1967 till date. The owners of the territory of Biafra are defending their heritage of freedom. Okay. Another person said, I think they said they, uh, they are Oga. Why are they running? Okay. Another person said, said they will regret, uh, they will ever regret coming to Biafra land. Okay. Another person said, our men are doing the needful exactly. Another person said, the way I see this, more gallant, more gallant men are joining in line. Spirit of Biafra is powerful. God bless his gallant. He's gallant. Okay. Another person said, it doesn't matter what anybody does or say, Biafra must come. For it is written, never again generation. The referendum now to save lives from Madike and the Maze Namdekano. Now, may Chukwu Kikabema continue to bless Maze Simon Ewa and uh, Madike and all be your friends all over the world. He said, and that person said, is the fearless uh, bike man Okada or <laughs> Okada or Mosi men <laughs> will be like, will be like them get spare life. Look at the one, how one is sitting down and shooting the terrorist without fear. Our gallant man, that is why Musa is panicking. That is why Musa is panicking. Musa said it himself. These boys are not human. They haven't seen anything. Do you, how do you think you can conquer somebody in his, in his own land? No, what makes them believe they can conquer us in our own land? Things they cannot do in the north, they're coming to southeast to do it. I think they can go on challenge. Gone are those days. Gone are those days. I will allow you to watch the video. I will put the link so that you watch the video. You see how one, one of our gallant men was comfortably sitting down neutralizing the terrorist. That is why they are panicking. Because Musa all his life have never seen this kind of a thing. Men are defending their land, defending their land, their people's lives and properties. And they will stop at nothing until all those uh, terrorists are flushed out. So that is it, dear friends. I will stop here. Don't forget to share. Like, leave your comment at the comment section. More strength and more victory in all front. For our gallant men, the more these terrorists come to Biafra land, the more they meet their end. We are not stopping for anybody. Thank you all.